this will be my first video on YouTube. Sorry for the loud noise. Anyways, we're going to be drawing a fox. Now, I'd like to first point out that we have a few camera issues, and that's not a lie. After all, I'm making a mistake over here, and you can't see my mistake. I was just drawing a line, and the camera was in the way. But anyways, while I'm talking into this microphone, I can tell you what's going to happen. So sit tight. Now we're going to draw a fox. And right here, I'm trying to draw an ear. And I just realized my mistake and I'm going to have to erase it again. On paper, it looks terrible. But we can live with a mistake. So we're going to draw this um, circle. And a circle always helps when you're trying to draw a head. So I'm going to draw a circle near where the line is so that we can like disguise it. And you gotta disguise your mistakes, after all. So right here, we have the circle being in progress. And ta-da, just a little polishing, and we're good to go. We're gonna zoom in the camera here. And you obviously cannot see it. Well, you can see a faint version of it. But don't worry, we'll fix that up later in the video. Now we're gonna draw an ear. Now this ear is gonna be too large. And watch, he's gonna have to erase it again. What I tell you. So, we're gonna try and make this ear smaller. And there we go. And you cannot see at all my, the ear. Talk about terrible camera issues. I don't even know how to use the thing. Look, I'm trying to make the ear flap down so it hides the person's eye. Yeah, that's not going to work. We're trying to make a short drawing video. So, as we can see, we have the first ear done. It's a bit much more contrast, dark contrast than the other part of the head. Uh, we can still dark and everything's gonna be dark anyways. So we're making the ear of our anthropomorphic fox And voila it looks like a cat, but trust me. It's a fox Now we're going to erase the side of the mouth And we're gonna make some fur because I was using some picture of a fox as a reference and he had a bunch of fur in his cheek so why not just put a bunch of fur in the cheek of this thing too. Might not be very interesting of a fur but it's good nonetheless. Just make the fur right. Alright. Now we're just going to dip it down so you have the snout of our character. Voila. Now we just need to make a nose. Now, we need to make the eyes. And the eyes are going to be really um, not so pretty, so we're going to have to um, disguise that later by making them into glasses. Going to disguise them my glasses, make them look nerdy. It's a good idea. And you cannot see it from this camera. Good job, camera. Alright. We're almost there. Hopefully we can see what's going on. Actually, there we are. You can see the glasses a bit. At least for a few seconds. Come on. So I believe right now what he's doing is he's putting the the fur on the ears so it looks like he's putting the eyeglasses into the ears because don't really have glasses that go that far unlike around the ear that would be nice but you know 
uh, give or take. Now we're making the neck of our character. And if you can see that little dot, that would be the mouth. Now, of course, people's shoulders are not that short. Shoulders are not short. So we're going to have to fix that one, too. We're going to make the shirt. Now we just dive it down, and now you have arms. Put a little collar there. Now we need something interesting. How about some glasses sunglasses I was going for like the shades but you know I kind of had a um, different idea when it came to the shades I decided to put it on a face and well normal sunglasses do not look like that if there is a sunglasses that looks like that I would like to see it now, I guess we're making a character on a shirt that has like some, like he's a bunny maybe? I was going for like one of those hipsters with a hat, but then I decided to add something else. Maybe it's an ear. Yeah, it's an ear. Now we just dive it down. Too lazy to make the other character issues. And you know, we have just about almost all the character parts, we just need hands. And trust me, the hands are the difficult part. So, what any reasonable person would do is give the person opposable thumbs and the rest of the fingers. Of course, your fingers do not look like that. They are on the opposite ends. So you're going to have to erase that, I'm sorry. Now you just slide it down, put a little perpendicular thingy, and you got yourself a finger. Do the same for the other side. And then you add your finger and you got hands. Then you put the finger marks over there, over there. You know what? We need to make our character badass so let's put some claws and then one extra claw alright looks good enough now we just need to add some a puff of fur on his neck cause why not see that see that faint stuff you can't see the rest you can't see it but it's good I put a thumbs up and my thumb is as terrible as this all right, we're going to darken it up, starting from the ear. And at the end of the video, I will probably do some editing and try to make this video, this picture very clear. I'll probably just take a picture on my own at, outside this video and make it look decent enough so you don't have to see this blur but it was a try nonetheless now we're going for the head
I suppose we'll do the, a part two of this. Because why not? We should we should add some more stuff to this guy. And he looks ar already part of some movie. So why not make another part two? So this idea of adding the snout downwards was new to me because when I when I tried to do it, I had pictures that um looked weird, like almost like it was part of a cartoon. All of these characters look like they're part of a cartoon, possibly an anime. Maybe fix the mouth a bit. No character looks that good without a poker face. Or slanted one. Fix up the tough of fur. And now you just need to make the arm like he's re he's like motioning something. Motioning outwards, like hugging maybe. Well, I don't think that guy wants to hug you, but after all he has his claws out, I think he has some other ideas, but he's motioning. He's making a hand gesture. I'll look up what the hand gesture is. I forgot. But fixing up the undershirt, the collar, everything's good. And you can't see the other arm. Almost there. Just make the other icon guy, um, bunny, visible because we all want to see the bunny. Or the, the shades bunny. Make the Sunglasses a bit nicer. Add a little bit of shading under his neck because, hey, he's, uh, he has a neck, right? All right. Now we're going to, at this moment, show you an actual picture of it. And here we have the character. I'm gonna go take another picture of it and I'll give you it right about now and there it is part two will probably be next and I'm um, probably tomorrow which is November 16 2016 that'll be tomorrow today's the 15th so have a good day or night